Good morning. Good evening, Twitter. This is your boy. And good night. My name is Narakessa, and you're watching Narakessa or Nehru. Hi, so today I don't have my mic clipped on me because we're actually going to move down to my desk. And what we're going to do on the desk is a little arts and crafts moment. The reason why I'm doing this is because I got a bag, which is over there. That's why I'm pointing behind me. I'm not just pointing just a point I got a bag full of art materials from my local art museum and they were like if you want to come on down come on down and pick up your um arts and crafts bag it was mainly for little kids my mom found it interesting she was like come on let's let's go get it I was like okay so that's what we're gonna do today we're gonna use what's in the bag to make some amazing arts and crafts thank you so now we're down here and we're gonna open this Appleton store bag. Let's dump out these contents. Paper, pencil, glue, glue, string on a stick, scissors, paper bag and watercolor, crayon, ruler, sharpener. They also gave me a postcard which has this lovely piece of art. So I first started out by sketching in my sketchbook some concepts and ideas. I went with a usual self-portrait of myself and I hopped right into sketching the drawing. So after sketching, I just um, hopped right into the watercolor and just added, they were actually really good. They're kind of school grade quality. But this brush, gotta go. Just your average um, beginner watercolors. I also use the pencil again to create any shadows and darken up any areas. Here you see me using the piece of paper and cutting and making a background. Just a nice fun texture moment. I went back in with the black watercolor which is actually surprising not too shabby but I had to like re-go over it later with some India ink. So yeah. <laughs> And finally, to finish off the piece, I decided to take some of the black craft piece of paper or from that paper thing, the same paper that I used to make the background, I started to make my locks in like a flowing wind position. I actually really liked how it came out, but what happened before is I used the stick and the string to do my locks before and it kind of really didn't turn out nice tried to dye the string black oh yikes now we're at the end of the video or close to the end of the video sorry that this video is kind of short I'm gonna show you the end videos of the drawing and how it came out and so yeah hope you enjoyed this video sorry it was short I'm in school it was on a short notice and I hope you enjoyed did I say that all again girl I'm a dumbass